falls weed in the bush. Sorry, I was delayed because there was a driveway down there and the homeowner came in as I was doing a light test. And just I had to make sure everything was good. Can you hear me all right? Can you talk louder? I don't really want to talk louder. How is everybody? Where, who is, who's all out there? <sighs> make sure it's set to... Um, oh. Oh, uh, we got McCool. Michael, how are you? Can you guess where I am yet? If you are a diehard Steve fan. This. Should be enough information. Sorry about the light. It sucks. It got darker a lot faster than I thought it was going to, actually. Hold on. Of course, I didn't have any time to repair before. Um, uh, David, no, the Frog Whisperer is not here. Uh, that's a little bit better. Here, I'll bring me a little bit. Closer as well. Bring it down. There we go. <clears throat> okay. Yes. Uh, has anybody guessed where I am yet? Oh, shit. In the dirt. Oh, gross. Man, it's all slimy and gross now. Sorry, hold on. I'm thirsty. I gotta get stealth Pepsi. Stealth Pepsi. Uh, hello, Lisa. Well, freaking light it up, Mark. Hidden hammock agrees with Kathy. What's, what did Kathy say? Hello, Kathy. Yeah, don't forget to smash that like button. Oh. Oh. Sorry, I needed that. Oh, I will play with the light again. There we go. Yes, I think we got her. Okay, we have a big joint. Uh, this is uh, some weed that I bought. I'm gonna try another dude, and it's uh, yeah, it's all right. So I am in a place that Steve has camped before, uh, about two years ago approximately at the same time uh, you can go back and check it out right now see if you can figure it out it was dropped October 1st 2020 Janet how are you uh, yes this is one of Steve's stealth spots I drove an hour and 20 minutes to get here today uh, when I was driving it was 33 degrees outside. That's like, I think I Googled that. I was like 91 ish Fahrenheit. Man, that's ridiculous. That's too hot for us Albertans. Um, right now it's like 23 degrees. We have a, uh, Uh, 
Some fat kid, AK pork chop. Uh, yeah, you're correct. Uh, Alberta's film. Hello from Calgary. Uh, you might know where I am. Well, if you follow my clue, you will know where I am. Hopefully, nobody lives in Camrose and was watching this right now. <laughs> well, yeah, we have a bit of a smoke warning or something like that, air quality warning. Uh, I guess there's some fires in California that are blowing this way. So it's kind of weird outside right now. The wind is kind of starting to pick up, but it's the temperature dropped really fast. Ah, uh, Matthew, how are you? Uncle Dubs? Oh, Uncle Dubs, I missed it. That's too bad. I'll have to watch it later. Uh, Peter says he's from, are you from Camrose? Oh, California. <laughs> uh, okay, it's Smokey and Moose Jaw, Corey says. Dad says it's not Smokey and Swift Current. I think that's where he's at. Uh, Lower Michigan, yeah, it's 420. It's always 420 here. I guess Jasper's on fire this week. I did not know that, actually. Yeah, it's from all this pothead smoking weed. That's why it's so smoky outside. Uh, smoky bad in Washington. Uh, Matthew, the next one is a store-bought blunt hand-rolled. It is fantastic. I already tried it. Definitely a busy road. Um, I think I'm okay. I think I'm okay with the light. We might move over to the other corner here in a bit. Uh, hopefully we get a break in traffic. We can do a sneak run around and see. Uh, Royal Wedding Cake, and it's pretty good, right on Janet. Um, uh, Hidden Hammock, it, it took me an hour and a half to drive, and then it was about a mile walk to uh, from the car here. And I brought my big back duffel bag thinking it looked less suspicious but by the time I got all my shit in there it was over full and it weighed ridiculously amount but uh, I picked up garbage on the way here to make myself look less suspicious as I'm going hmm I should have brought the garbage can backpack because that would have worked perfect um, but you know you know whatever it worked so yeah picked up a bit of garbage on the way here and then snuck in. Uh, it took a bit to get in actually. I had to wait for traffic. It was busy. Yeah, Lisa, you're right. You always bring too much stuff. And I even knew this, like I didn't bring my tarp, I didn't bring, you know, all that good stuff. Uh, plan is just to set up the cot and sleep on the cot. I'm hearing dark dogs barking from the, there's a house over there, you'll see it in the video on the way in. The smell and the weed. Yeah, McCool's Michael, you always take way too much stuff. 
Uh, hello, Steve. How are you? Uh, yes. Uh, this is definitely a historic location. And uh, honestly, the walk up, it definitely, definitely had the emotions running. I mean, I, I walked on the same path that he walked to get to this spot. So, you know, that was definitely, definitely powerful. So, and uh, the supper is going to be pretty epic too. <laughs> yeah. But yeah, no, it's pretty awesome. This is a uh, pretty sweet spot. Dr. Robert, puff, puff, pass to myself, brother. Everybody else, light them in if you got them and if you drink them. Yeah, it's uh, weed that I got. You know, it's still a good deal and all. It just, quality's qu not quite there. Not quite there. Uh, Kathy mentioned an idea about having a stealth camper from the America side and the Canadian side. Stealth camp side by side. I mean, the future is the future is out there. It's just this is just beginning. So we just, we just keep that mem that that idea rolling, and maybe one day we'll make it happen. Um, I still want to go ahead with a stealth worldwide stealth camping weekend where everybody goes stealth camping on the same weekend and then posts posts it just as you please after that but i think that'd be badass uh camping with a dab in washington yeah i mean right that's lisa's close to me too uh dr robert yeah go sit outside get high get stoned with weed in a bush Behind the sign. Camp. Jesus, that's a big spider right there. I might have to just uh, dispose of him. I don't like spiders. Uh, sorry, buddy. Hopefully, nobody's seen me do that. Oh, shit. Drop the joint. Well, I'm tired of this joint. Yeah, well, I think uh, I think we should be able to see the sign here, Josh. It has uh, traffic has definitely died down a little bit. Uh, there goes an ambulance. So let's uh, let's light another joint here and see what we can do. Uh, this is the first joint I smoke of this episode, so all the information will be really good there. desert uh, I don't know if I could stealth camp in the desert uh, yeah that would be a fun thing to see if we could schedule um, so nice to meet you thank you sorry Lisa sorry it was right there beside me and big and just hanging out and I'm sleeping here if I had like a tent, I do. I brought his. I brought the same bivy that he does. But, anyways, uh, this is the the loud plug. It is guava biscuit blunts, and the guy says they're more of a hand rolled type style. And on the back here it says uh, handcrafted pre rolls. And let me. These are yes. Again, you'll be able to see this really good on the episode. Um, first joint, well, second joint, because I smoked one in the van before I left. Let's see what I can do here real quick. Just wait, there's a car coming. Just don't want to move the light around while there's some tension drawn. Right. Yeah, hand rolled for sure. Like, that's straight up a blunt paper. Oh man. 
And tastes like it too. Yeah, I like the border idea. That'd be fun. I mean, like where Steve's location was, I know where that was. And, uh, I mean, somebody could camp on the other side of that. Easy. Yeah, so there's, you know, there's ways. It could be done. So it could be done. Oh, sweet Lisa. I'd love to have one of those things. Love to. Um, well, I guess let's see if we can go see the sign before it gets pitch black. Because I can't really... I think once we get out of the trees here, we'll be able to see a little bit better. Hold on. Hold on. I'm stuck on the branches. Okay. Okay. Man, it's pretty, uh, on me or something's going on here. Hold on. Spider Lisa. It's crawling on me. I wonder about the smoke. Do you think uh Okay, there we go. Do you think they can see the smoke? Oh there's a truck turning right there. Steve the legend self camped right here. Cause I mean I can see the smoke from the, the light. Jack Coffee, how are you? Uh, John OG, um, how are you? Uh, smoking Rainbow Chip 44% THC. Whew. Uh, spider or something on me here again. Ugh. Sorry. Just looking at bushes, my bad. Jody, how are you? <laughs> oh, sorry, Lisa. <laughs> I'm just trying to flip back around here. Camaros, welcome to Camaros. Uh, this is my first self camp behind a sign. Um, I'm always looking for them, but Steve found this one. He found this one for sure. <sighs> oh. 
Okay, Matthew. This, uh... Hold on, let me get my light on the go again here. This blunt... I mean, I've smoked quite a bit of store-bought joints before, right? Like, I mean, you've seen them all. And usually, I don't smoke store-bought off-camera. It's just... So, you know, it's not that many, but I do. And this thing is fan freaking tastic man. Uh, Jack off, he absolutely, we love Steve Wallace. We love uh, Jessica. I met her once at Steve's birthday, about a year ago. And uh, she is an absolute wonderful person. Uh, it's definitely, definitely sad news. But I figure, you know, you just, if everybody just stopped and Because they knew somebody who died stopped doing what they were doing, then nothing would ever get done. Um, so, I mean, we can throw out our tributes and our sadness and say we're, we're sorry. And then we just got to you know, keep trugging along doing what we want to do. And just always be in memory of Jessica. That's, that's the way I look at it. Uh, on the episode, I gave this a 9.5 out of 10, and 100% I'm doing it again right now. This thing is fantastic. Uh, it tastes like you're smoking a blunt. It burns absolutely cleaner than clean. And, like, it just, I, the, the one I smoked earlier, geez, I actually had some nice good oil running down the side, and, oh yeah, no, this is, There's Danny Long Light. Uh, right on. That is good. That infused joint. That's awesome. Uh, Lisa, yeah, I, I agree. Absolutely. Such an up and down. And then his birthday's coming up in a couple days. And No, 100%, man. I can't even imagine what what he'd be going through. Well, I hope he just uh, I don't know, hope he does what I would do, and I would just, especially if you're you're already making money, you're already living off of YouTube. Uh, man, I'd freaking uh, uh, Jack Offie. Can you send me an email? Uh, I would like to sleep. How are you? Uh, send me an email. Uh, it's my email is wheelercpaul at outlook.com. And I'll send you emails if you want, I guess. Um, but it's on my about section on my YouTube page. Send me an email, and I'll send you my address. Ouch. Uh, yeah, so no, it's definitely, definitely sad about Steve for sure. But again, I mean, you know, I had this pick before and I don't know. I think it's awesome. I think it's awesome. Uh, can we start a group? Can we start as a group? Start a GoFundMe? I... He, he probably already has so many donations rolling in right now. I bet you a GoFundMe would not... Well, I mean, of course it would work. But, I mean, it, maybe it's done already. I don't know. I don't check. But... I think he'll do all right.
busy freaking house. There's another vehicle that went down there. Jody hasn't seen one, that's why you mentioned it. Um, oh, that's no good. You see, see if you can polish it out. Yeah, Lisa, uh, you are correct. You got back out there, and and that's the way I would too. I mean, if, if I was, especially again in his situation already making money enough to survive off of YouTube um, yeah Janet I did see that somewhere uh, I'm mega taco right on uh, I'm smoking this hand rolled store-bought blunt it's uh, fantastic I give it a nine and a half out of ten uh, Weed balls. Uh, Dr. Robert, yeah, I believe that. I, again, I, it would be tough, but I feel like I know I'd, I'd just hit it hard. Hit it freaking hard. Make cool videos and just bam, bam, bam. Dedicate the next 10 years of his life to YouTube. And then he won't have to freaking do anything. When he turns 50, he just say, yeah, no, I'm done. And he'll just keep rocking in the freaking dough. That's just, that's just my opinion. Uh... Yeah, absolutely. I uh, bubble mints would like to sleep. The bubble hash is melting nice. Has root. That's good. I'm. I love hash. Uh, <laughs> Taking toes, taking toes. It's definitely a busy road. brought my vape pen let's uh truck just left again, that one that just then off screen. So, definitely got to be mindful of that freaking place. It's uh, pretty busy. Hold on. Putting you back in your holder. Hold on, sorry. Cross shot. Oh. What's going on here? Why can't I do it? Uh, John OG, uh, I was talking about the vape pen here.
Uh, Mega Taco, no. I don't have any freaking pens. But I had a jet boil. I, yeah. Uh, Matthew, one of my members, Matthew's here. He, he, uh, he mentioned it to, to me during the video drop, and I just. <laughs> I had a lighter the whole time. A big giant fucking lighter. So let's uh let's get the vape pen and then we'll go sit back over there. It's less smoky, so I I think it'll be a less giveaway. And uh we'll try that. We haven't done that on the show yet, have we? There might be a bit more hacking and coughing because it's hard on my throat, but Let's uh let's do that. Uh, uh, oh getting up is hard. I I actually wasn't prepared for this. I was prepared with all these joints and stuff and then I thought, you know what, this is this is way cooler. Let's do this. Okay, bear with me here. Hold on. Um, oh yeah, I put it in that other little pocket. This is a good view. Here. Oh no, I still just mop my side, so never mind. Alright, hold on. Oh, I'm stuck in the trees. Shit. <clears throat> Ouch, pokies. Oh. You can't really see me, can you? There we go. Hashtag Stealth Camping Alliance. Weed in the bush. Steve, this craziness is to you. Thanks for finding the spot and thanks for letting me borrow it. Uh, Jody, just use your phone, man. <laughs> Fantastic. Oh, yeah, I gotta go get my tripod. I took it off my tripod way over there. Now there's a whole bunch of traffic. see me a bit. Ah. Schooly, yes. This is a pretty sweet spot. You should know this spot. Or at least know kind of of it anyway. And really, um, 
anybody who followed the information I did earlier. Uh, he dropped his video October 1st, 2020 of this same location. So that means he was here sometime in September. Here it is. Ah. Oh. Um, yeah, Matthew, I'm not too sure what's going on, but yeah, let's not talk about, I guess, really sad shit. Should we do one more joint? I mean, that was only like, I guess, two. Uh, OMJ. OMJ, yep, yep. I mean, this thing, it's just. He says, oh, I'm Jay. Man, that freaking smoke going over the sign. I think maybe we will, but I might relocate to... Definitely stealth camping here. Well, let's go sit. I kind of blocked around this place for a little bit here. Okay, hold on. Let's get one more joint. Uh, anything special? Should we smoke anything special? Uh, Robert, no worries. We'll be here for a good 20 more minutes or so. Anything special? Anybody want to smoke anything special? Store bought. Uh, three of them. Anything I got? Uh, thanks, doctor. Sending one, sending you one back. Um, just be strong, man. I don't know. I haven't had any experience like that, so I don't really know what to say. Um, smoke hash, bro. I don't got any hash. Give me 30 seconds here. Well, uh... Should we just smoke the trident? Should we do that? I kind of want to do that. We'll have to move spots, I think. Those guys great on freaking great headlights. Um, okay, well let's uh I, I didn't uh I was like oh when it gets dark you won't be able to see the smoke but you can totally see the smoke because the sign's there. So let's see what we can do about just hiding that a little bit more. Hold on here, let's move a little over here.
stay behind the sign here. I don't got much room over on this side. There's no way. I may totally have just seen the Hino, one of our tow truck drivers, drive that way. Shane, if you watch this, was that you? I'm gonna message you. Actually, I might have to just message him right now. Uh, I gotta go get my chair and I'll go get the Trident. So can you guys chill for all of 30 seconds? Can you hang, hang out? For the love of Happy Halloween, how are you? Uh, smoking Oreo cookies. So I did do a quick run around the uh, corner and down the thing. See? And I think we'll be all right. Um, shit. I wrote, okay, this, these are three different flavors. One of them is Tweed. One of them is Furger. I think Black Cherry Punch. And one of them is... Uh, Live. Live? Something like that. Uh, Route 66. They're all sitting around that 21%. THC, they're not, ah, they're, they're all right weeds. So let's see if I can get this lit here in the wind. Uh, thank you, Jody. Thank you, thank you. Sorry guys. Oh, I love this thing too. Those guys don't see me. And again, I ran out to kind of about halfway where I can see the cars can see me. And if I'm just sitting here, it would look like there's just a light in the trees. So I think it would be all right. Uh, Lower Michigan video is dropping or dropping in a half hour. 200 subscriber giveaway. I'm not too sure what it said. Something popped up. Uh, I don't even G U R U R C's. Three blunts to put in there. Yeah, well, I don't know. I have a hard time getting them in there. I roll such big joints.
Yeah, smash that. Yeah, and see now, I don't know, I feel like the smoke, the wind's stronger here, so it's just blowing it through the trees, and I think it's better here to do this, so. Man, I can already feel all three of them coursing through. Oh, sweet, Lisa, you're camping right now, right on. Cheers, brother. Uh, yeah, this is, I love this thing. I got it off Amazon for 20 bucks. So I figured I had to. It'd be fun, It'd be fun, fun, fun. Yeah, it took me uh, took me an hour and a half to get here. Yeah, everybody, light up, because once these three are done, we're done, because that's going to be ridiculous. Still got to make supper to be like Steve. Um, if you watch the video, it should be... Just about the same thing that he made. Hint, hint, wink, wink. Uh, doctor, I think she just means like a government site. Whoa, man. Whew. Maybe I should have set the cod up first. <laughs> Cones are, are squidgy bottles for me? What do you mean, Jono? You mean like the backside gets all loose and gross and shit? Uh, JTR, how are you? Uh, alien OG, you bet. I don't know what I just did there. Uh, yeah, they're gonna get pretty. Oh yeah, that breeze is picked up, and I don't know. You can tell that it's smoky. Uh, I didn't have it. Definitely gonna be riding the rip. Definitely, this is, maybe, this, maybe we should have started with this. Uh, yes, uh, Jennifer, I probably should have. Because now it's going to be all difficult. <laughs> uh, can you see the lights? What do you mean by that, uh, poor chap? Are you flashing lights at me? Do you want to come hang out? It's more joint. Just let me know you're here. Is that you? smoking enough
I can see those lights. Those are a lot of lights. That poor guy that you're following. <laughs> uh, anyways, let's uh, see. And I don't know if I can rotate so you guys can maybe see the road behind me now. Let's just see what happens here. I don't want to get my shadow in the go here, right? I don't know. We'll see. There should be maybe there'll be something driving by in the darkness here, maybe. And if I just kind of try to sit fairly still. Oh, see, we're a little low. So let's go up a bit. There we go. There we go. I sit up straight and don't move. I, don't know, I think I'd, I'd see it because I'd be looking. <laughs> it's a busy road. There might have been a few joint smoked this location by other people. But I doubt anybody smoked a trident before. Frickin' ripped. Middle one's uh, quarter left and the other two are half. Matthew says he Googled it and said that uh, there's one that holds five joints. That is ridiculous. That's crazy. Uh, I guess let's do a bit of story time here. In high school, uh, we used to smoke cigarettes. Quite a bit of cigarettes. And I was in mechanics class and I found this uh, vacuum adapter. It was, you know, about that tall. Well, like that big around, and it had one, two, three. It had five. Yeah, it had five freaking, like, vacuum ports off of it. And immediately, I thought, joints. But we didn't want to waste five joints on it at that point. So we tried it with five cigarettes. But we did end up using it for joints, and it was awesome. So yeah, we've we've done five. Uh, but it was this homemade rig with tin foil, and this yeah, it was. But it was fun. <laughs> and they were not big joints like this at all. They were tiny little pinners. But uh, yeah, hashtag Stealth Camping Alliance, uh, be like Steve. That was awesome. Uh, Jordy says, only handle uh, two at a time. Well, this will be number five, right? We're at five already, so let's... And uh, I can tell you, I don't... Uh... Definitely don't need any more after this one. The middle one's just about done, unfortunately. Yeah, pretty sweet spot, I'd say. Uh, I'd say it's pretty sweet, for sure. I've been thinking about it for a long time, planning it. Um, yeah. And then, boom! But, whatever. 
I'm here. I'm having fun. You guys are having fun. Uh, make sure you watch the video. It'll be coming out on the 10th, obviously. And uh, as they all seem to go, it'll be... Hi, let's plow with weed in the bush, and then it'll get dark and be like... Holy cow, man. Freaking ripped. But that's fun. Gotta keep that middle one in there for a plug or it's not gonna work. So now we're down to two. Down to two. Frick, and they're still like two, two half joints. It's almost bigger than half joints. Uh, alien OG. He's not no no myth. I've met him. He is definitely the legend. Definitely the legend. Um. I kind of think we're just stuck with this view. Honestly, I don't really feel. comfortable running around around here because I did notice that house over there has a window looking in on us that was an ambulance if you must know but yeah make sure you go just watch everybody's video on the Tenth. Uh, make sure you just mention that hey, awesome for still getting out there and doing it. And, you know, sorry about your loss, Steve, and kind of stuff like that. And we'll get this done and over with, and and we'll move on. Uh, we are going to do the airport challenge in September as well. And then uh, there's that World Cleanup Day, right? I, uh, I picked up garbage today. I might just use bits of that too for my world cleanup day video. But yeah, remember that. Uh, that's there too. Great. Um, uh, I guess gas prices. Let's quickly talk about gas prices. Uh, here they are like anywhere from a dollar twenty two to a dollar twenty five a liter. Yeah. That is awesome. Uh Michael. Yeah, this is fun. This has been a fun one. I knew it was gonna kinda be stuck in the corner darkness. Uh, I figured it'd be back there the whole time, but the smoke just kinda more bothered me more than the light. And even being out here, the, the light bothered me less than the smoke did over there. You know what I mean? See, everybody's brake lights go on, but it's because it's coming into town and they got to start slowing down. Whew. Frickin' ripped, guys. Uh, Jennifer, that's sweet, fantastic. Um, I think even if you can, if you can share it, make a video and even just put a short something on, uh, Matthew, hold on a second. Um, put it on Facebook or something. I'm pretty sure somebody, like Raul, would make a, world cleanup video if we all pitched in just a couple minutes of our time it would be sweet it would show lots of respect I think so uh, frostbite you're funny 
Yeah, Matthew says, what do you what do you get when you cross the snowman with the vampire? Uh, frostbite. <laughs> I'm excited for winter. are open now. Well guys, I'm going to start saying uh, goodbye. Uh, doctor doesn't like camping in the winter. Uh, stinky stealth pocket. Stinky pocket stealth. How are you? Uh, again, I was just about to say goodbye here. Why did the football coach go to the bank? Why, Jody? Well, why? Uh, to get a quarterback. To get his quarterback. I got it. I got it before I read it. I got it before I read it. Yeah, well, guys, um, I'm pretty freaking ripped. I'm going to call that a uh, success here. That one's out, and that one I'm. ripped uh, uh, thank you Michael uh, smoke weed every day uh, yeah you have to rewatch Stinky Stealth Pocket <laughs> always get it wrong Stinky yeah Stinky Pocket Stealth ridiculous um, yes the trident we smoked the trident on a live stream behind the camera sign in honor of steve and his wife jessica uh thanks for hanging out with me for an hour in the dark just a reminder winter is coming and this is what it will be all the time but honestly i bet you we might even have to keep them down to a half hour just because my phone might get so cold sometimes not all the time uh, that it might just shut off just be a little critter down there or something but yeah um yeah make sure everybody watches the videos on his birthday uh, throw him a happy birthday comment and Make sure you use the at Steve Wallace because then he'll at least get notified that they're there. And again, some people aren't. You don't feel right about doing it and some people are doing it. Um, but again, like I said in my video too, if you have dropped a Wallace challenge video prior to the September 10th. Uh, Matthew says he can't wait to winter camp. I am 100% agreeing with you. I cannot wait. I am ready for it. I am not, but I am excited for it. Uh, yeah, winter is coming to Canada. Uh, there will be some footage of the combines combining the fields the trees are yellow and i'm working so much i think i put in like 65 hours last week so much needed break it's hot hot all week oh hot 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 this week's supposed to be like a little bit more normal temperatures like the 20 ish 22 degrees ish so that's sweet
going to end this, guys. We'll see you during the video. Thanks for joining. Good night. I got to go.